right the subject which we are going to study is the structural analysis this is one of the important topics as you know that the engineering mechanics strength of materials structural analysis then the design part design part consists of steel structures and rcc so this is still here the analysis it means the basics of engineering mechanics basics of strength of materials then those will be the basics for uh, the analysis part now here the actual analysis part we are going to study the topics which will be uh, dealing here is the structural that is the statically determinate structures statically determinate structures consists of the trusses arches beams cables frames all this will be dealing in the structurally structure analysis of statically determinate structures now the next topic which we are going to see is indeterminate structures statically indeterminate structures statically indeterminate structures we have different methods uh, to study here like the force method these are different methods force method then the displacement method whatever are the familiar topics which you know movement distribution method and slope deflection method they will be coming under diff displacement method it is also called as deflection method displacement method there are some other names for us for the for those also we will be studying in the coming part then we have the influence line diagrams influence line diagrams these are one of the important topics again we'll be studying about the moving loads over here moving loads consists of do you know anything about moving loads moving loads generally we consider the loads of the vehicles which are moving over a flyover or a bridge right then we'll be seeing the matrix methods right in all these topics if you uh, see overall in a broad view we'll be learning we can classify as we'll be learning about the mostly the trusses indeterminate trusses and determinate trusses how to analyze them are the methods again the slope deflection method moment distribution method the matrix method is also one of the method which is used to analyze the structures <coughs> determinate or indeterminate method matrix method mostly is used in the case of uh, the computers the softwares whatever you have now the analysis softwares those will be using the matrix methods right now as per your gate exam is concerned the topic is going to take around i mean 24 to 30 hours but your weightage for the exam will be around 10 to 12 marks
you might have seen the previous question papers in every question paper you will be finding this you will be finding the questions relating to the structural analysis right then the preferred books the books which are preferred are let me say the theory of structures by ramamrutam you can follow this book because it consists of number of examples then you have theory of structures by again bc punmia this will give you the concepts then there is one more book which is very good for the basics Uh, which is uh, by written by R C Hibbler. This is very good for the basics. Then for matrix methods or matrix analysis, the best book is Pandit and Gupta. right 